link down below if you want to read this on your own. It weighs in at about 14 gigabytes depending on your platform. New content river raid updates added three new rivers to the river raids game mode. Arif, Burba, Rhine. Phase 2 river champions and the new champions of the faith. Defeat them to get your hands on new weapons. Added new rewards to river raids. Lungs armor and five weapons including a short sword. Yom's Viking hull can be upgraded to level 4 to 5. Allowing players to hire Yom's Viking of level 4 to 5 respectively. Yom's Viking of higher rank can carry more rations and do more damage to enemies. River Raid Longship Cargo can be upgraded to level 5 from 4. Three new abilities can be found in River Raid Monasteries. Spinning Harpoon, Percussion Arrow, Precision Axe Throw. Then we've got Rune Perk Changes, Targeted Rune Socketing. This update means that runes will only affect the weapon they are socketed in, allowing players to create more targeted loadouts. For example, you can fill your left hand weapon with attack runes and your right hand weapon with stun runes so that both weapons have very different effects. Some stats will stay global. So for example, assassination damages, fire damages, etc. No changes have been made to runes slotted on armor. They will still impact your character as a whole. Perk and rune perk cap removal. Say that a hundred times fast. We also removed the cap that prevented perks and rune perks, diamond shape, effects from stacking beyond a certain threshold. Well, I didn't. They did. Players will now save the impact of their perks and be able to create more specialized loadouts. Difficulty setting adjustments. Added a seer nightmare. Combat difficulty to the game. 200% more damage received. Standard damage inflicted. Minus 40% ration heals. Minus 38% parry timing window. Players will now heal according to their selected difficulty settings. Easy and default, 100. Hard, 80. Very hard, 60. Nightmare, 60. Odin's Blessing Community Tattoo Contest. Added Community Tattoo Contest items to the game. El Fidil on Twitter. Oh, okay, yeah. Torso Chest. Outer Desert on Instagram. Head. Le Papillon 08 on Instagram for torso and back. Shirley's Art on Instagram arms. Have a head over. Helps if I can speak. To Ubisoft Connect to unlock Odin's Blessing for free. From September 7th at 2 p.m. UTC. Game Improvements. Miscellaneous. Updated the below skill notes to include the new weapon types as follows. Short Sword equals Great Sword Skill Node. Scythe equals Spear Skill Node. Sickle equals Sea Axe Skill Node. Players who cannot upgrade their settlement to level 6 due to lack of supplies will now be able to purchase supplies at the settlement. Merchant, only available at level 5 and once a specific amount of supplies have been collected. Players didn't take damage from fire after destroying a boat. Players not receiving XP after completing daily quests in Ireland and Francia. Longship missing or could be seen spawning in river raids, expansions 1 and 2. PC. Photos deformed when taken in non-native aspect ratio in borderless window mode. La Siege de Paris. Expansion number 2. We've addressed the following issues. Players could re-enter l'île de la Cité through unintended means. Sorry folks. The church gatekeeper from the rot in the slums is not at the gate, causing the investigation to disappear. Spoilers in 3, 2, 1. Addressed several issues with the boss fight and madness of King Charles. Longship sales to be opened during the dialogue scene upon arrival in Francia. Quest marker is misplaced on the Atlas of Homecoming. The duelist remained stuck on the mount and did not fight the player. Numerous issues with the barn bull fight. Siegfried could get stuck in the rot, in the slums, if players placed a horse on the stairs. World map isn't open after pressing the relevant key during the Rebel Mission tutorial. The player cannot exit Little Mother's Sanctum if the conflict is initiated with either of the two NPCs in the tunnel before the Dagger Room. Confirm kill scenes missing for the Duelist Hunter Cavalier. Under certain circumstances, the duelist cannot be completed if the dead body is being carried around after taking them down. 
The duelist shapes follow his dead body if the player carries it around. Give this video a thumbs down and I'll make sure you're that dead body that people are lugging around showcasing in the world of Assassin's Creed. Don't ask me what that was. Players could interact with the door from the other side in the Gisakum rune. I'm not even going to touch that one because it's kind of sticky. It's just saying. Cannot progress in Little Mother <laughs> after distracting her with explosive corpse triggering the event. I need more sleep. Addressed an issue that caused the finisher camera to not be disabled in the Siege de Paris, despite turning it off in the menu. Wrath of the Druids Expansion 1. Addressed bed in Dublin was no longer accessible. Courting the Kings does an update after freeing prisoners. Trial of the Morrigan cannot be started if it is if it has been completed in a previous playthrough. Dublin's reach couldn't be completed as Azar was Aladdin, dead. Black Shuck attacked the player before the start cinematic camera ends. Main quests, world events, and side activities. Address the following issues. Daily quest dialogue scene. Takes a long time to load and will end up having the camera underground when the daily quest menu opens. Bassam was missing at the beginning of severing the lines. Unable to complete under the skin as Vili was stuck in the water. Quest marker missing and smashing the compass probably shouldn't have smashed that compass. Unable to speak to Soma after regrouping in an island of eels. Unable to go fishing with Colbert in Bloody Path to Peace. Colbert will never know peace. Unable to complete the world event king of the Hay People. Or unable to complete the investigation as the three clues in the absence of the Elderman. Unable to complete the quest walls and shadows as the cinematics didn't start. It's all walls and shadows. No stones around to complete the Stone Man mystery. Unable to complete the Eurovisaisher arc, whatever the hell that word is, as player received road to Hamartia after completing this son of Jorvik. I almost said hernia. Old Cellar Mystery couldn't be completed as the tablet wasn't there. The gnome took it. Unable to interact with NPC and Goddess of Birth, players sometimes didn't receive orphans or the fence after completing the quest, The Great Scattered Army. Unable to access the quest, The Way of the Berserker, with Ubisoft Connect overlay disabled. The duel with Dag didn't trigger after sleeping during a storm is brewing. Hunwall doesn't follow Eivor. If they meditate after a drinking minigame in Homecoming. Too much vodka. The boss's extended, inextended family could get stuck under certain, certain circumstances. Just like I'm getting stuck trying to pronounce these damn words. A plague of rats not working during the last phase of the fight with Dag. River raids and the mastery challenge. These have been addressed. Enemies disappearing from some river raid locations after looting a chest, or it resets. Looting resource chest does not award fabrics after fully completing at least one mastery challenge shrine. Unable to return to the settlement after a river raid. Unable to start the river raids tutorial after loading an autosave twice during a river to raid. And PCs fell from their stations occasionally and died in mastery challenge. Oil jars exploded before entering the Temple Bro. Fort range challenge of exiting and restarting the trial after destroying them. The alert level didn't increase when raiding a fortress. Mastery challenge achievements and trophies didn't transfer between platforms. Gold medal couldn't be attained anymore during stealth trial. And Kaleva outpost under certain circumstances. I want to know what these certain circumstances are. Graphics, audio, and animation. Right now, my eyes are doing a lot of weird animations. Addressed numerous graphical and lighting issues, various animation issues, and numerous menu narration issues. Gameplay, combat, and AI. Addressed the following numerous NPC behavior issues. Finisher cameras for some animal takedowns isn't disabled, while option is turned off. The world. Oh boy, the world needs a massive update. Addressed. 
instances where Eivor NPCs or the longship would get stuck. Instances of misplaced or floating objects or textures. Fast travel to viewpoints while disembarking could cause Eivor to offset from the location. User interface and HUD addressed numerous UI HUD issues, numerous VFX, GFX, UI elements that weren't adapted for colorblind modes. The sort by call to action in the runes section will now display the next sorting option available and not the one that's currently applied. Skills and abilities address Paladin perk for increased stamina consumption on attack didn't apply. Scythe of Tribulation perk wasn't working correctly. Couldn't sprint while on the mount after acquiring Hadron Slam. Moon's Cut perk activated if the player shot any object. Autopathing is not functional on main skill nodes. Eivor kept an arrow in their hand after using some range abilities. Well, in Skyrim, we all know the famous NPC that said, you know, I took an arrow to the knee. Anyways, this one, he took it. Anyways, whatever. I don't even know where I was going with that. Crescent Shield's perk activates only once after a parry and doesn't stack. Performance and stability. Improved performance and stability. That's about it for the patch. Well, I fucking hope so. It was long enough. So as always, if you liked the video, go ahead, give it a thumbs up. It greatly helps support the channel with the algorithm. If you didn't like the video, well, you know it's coming. Go ahead, give it a thumbs down. And I'll make sure the next time you play the game, this is what happens to your beloved Eivor. I'll do it. I will eat your ass. Here comes the pain. <laughs> and if you want to subscribe to the channel, I mean, obviously, that would be great now, wouldn't it? But if not, whatever. Thanks for stopping by anyways. Take care. Who knows? Maybe I'll see some of you in the next video. Bye for now.